in this video i'm going to show you how to make a drop down list in the google sheets so once you are on your google sheet like this we want to select invoice okay okay so we're going to create a price list so all you want to do is just click on this add sheets all right so uh, we're going to rename this to price list <laughs> All right, so now you want to create uh, some price list. So we have our items and price right here, cats, dog, honey, and caps. Okay, so now back to our invoice. In here, we're going to replace these uh, descriptions. Okay, we're going to replace them with drop downs. All right, to do that, uh, what you want to do is you want to go to data and you go to data validation okay so you click on add rule so right here you want to click on drop down from range then you want to click on this select data range okay all right so then we're gonna click on price list and we're gonna select the range so this is the range we want and then you click on ok so back to our invoice once you select then uh, if we go back here, you can see that we have our items, dogs, and we can switch. Okay, so as you can see, the next thing you want to do, you can um, change, you can do the settings if you want to change this, um, this circle kind of, you just go down to advanced settings and you can change it to arrow. Okay, so it makes it easier okay so we're gonna go with this so now the next thing we want to do is um we want to update the price list so uh then we're gonna what you want to do is you want to put in c lookup right here okay then a 19 with comma so now we're gonna find the range so we're gonna go back to our price list select both columns Price A B. So once we select both columns, then we're gonna add in oops. Okay. So the range, the index sorted. This is our price list. So if we drag this down, oh uh, you can see we have an arrow. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna type in the prompt right here. Uh, if error okay then i'm gonna close it in this then you wanna enclose it in in this okay but this is where you want to type in if you have an error if error v lookup you want to type in, in like this so as you can see our price list has been so now our price list has been okay so as you can see so as we recorded all right so now if we click on cart logs on it so as you can see right. so now we can change our price list so for cards we have 100 dogs we have 200 apps we have 20 so uh if we have to change uh, our quantity so 600 so you can see the price list changes with it. So if I change cart, price list change with it. Honey is 300. If I change it back to dogs, it's 200. Okay. If we go back to our price list and let's say we want to add a new item. Let's say it's flower. $100. Okay. 
So if we go back to our invoice, you can see right here it's been added, as you can see. So you can see flowers been added. So if you add more items to your price list, it's gonna reflect. Cards. So as you can see, the total flex. So this is pretty much how to make a drop down list with uh Google Sheets. So if you gain something from this video, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Okay.